Lots of tubes. Seems it. Oh, like here. And today I have one of the most epic products that Konami has ever released. It is the Yugi's Legendary Dex. And I am super excited to pop this open and do an opening review on it because I, this is amazing. One of the most awesome things I think I've ever seen Yu-Gi-Oh! So I'm super excited for this. And as you guys can probably tell, I am very sick, or I have been very sick. I had the flu for like seven days. I wanted to post this video like a week ago, but I was not able to. So now it's Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving, you guys. And um, here I am, still sick, and I need to post this video. So here it is, one of the most epic products ever released, Yugi's Legendary Dex. And uh, thanks to our friends at Ultra Pro, you guys, we have this beautiful Hatsune Miku playmat. And we'll be using my, one of my favorite, the Teal Pro Mat sleeves for some of those foils in there. But yeah, let's uh, take off the wrapping real quick. So this is the Yugi's Legendary Dex. And this product, you guys, I think the MSRP, the price that stores were supposed to sell it at, was around $30. And before it was even released, it was already at $40. So if anything, I would just recommend you guys holding on to these sealed because it's probably going to be worth super duper amounts of money. All right. So Yugi's Legendary Dex. Actually, before we get to popping it open, let's check out the back. So it says here, now you can duel with all three decks used by the king of games. Yeah, Yugi's Exodia deck. 41 cards starring the unstoppable Exodia. Yugi's Battle City deck. 41 cards with a deck with the special red Dark Magician or the evil Dark Magician. And then Yugi's Gadget deck. 41 cards including the gadgets and the silent series monsters. And then uh, down here it also includes the three Egyptian God cards, electromagnetic new cards, and then the three historical cards um, plus a token. And the three historical cards, you guys, we'll check them out more, but those are the uh, reward cards. Or uh, Battle City, or not Battle City, sorry, uh, Forbidden Kingdom, that gets you your million dollars or your one wish. <laughs> and then uh, down here it says, Total Box contains three times 41 card decks, each including five ultra rare cards, 36 common cards, total of 15 ultra rares and 108 commons, plus three secret rare cards, three ultra rare Egyptian god cards, and then uh, four ultra rare commemorative cards. Both the god cards and commemorative cards are for collection purposes only. But yes, so one of the most awesome things I've ever seen. This is crazy, you guys. Wow. Magician of Black Chaos is in here, too. Oh, my God. So I have resisted looking at opening videos of this already online because I needed to psych myself up and just go over these awesome cards with you guys because this is the first time opening it. I don't know what's in here. First, let's check out the promo pack with the new cards and what, what have you. All right, here we go. Electromagnetic Turtle. Dark Renewal. Black Illusion. Until the end of turn, all dark spellcast type monsters with 2,000 or more attack are currently cannot be destroyed by battle and the effects and their effects are negated and they're unaffected by your opponent's card effects. That's cool. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. First of all, these secret rares look pretty sweet, like classic looking. I don't really like the uh, newer secret rares. Set sail for the kingdom. This card cannot be used in a duel. I believe this gets you on the boat. The Duelist Kingdom. Maybe get you into the kingdom. The glory of King's Hand. This will get you your treasure. Something like that. I cannot believe that they made these, you guys. This is insane. So many people are going to want to collect these. And just a normal Yu-Gi-Oh card. Wow. That is so awesome. I could sit here and just look at these three cards for 30 minutes. Alright, so we got to keep moving, though. We have the three god cards in here, which is insane. I cannot believe they put these in here. Like, no matter who you talk to, these are still worth, you know, like $5 a piece. So it's like, this is, this is insane. I cannot believe all these cards are in here. And then a Yugi token. And I want four of those for scapegoats. So, you know, we're going to have to sleeve up all these cards, you guys, because they're all that amazing. So give me a minute here. Ugh. And I will try my best to talk. I have sucked it up and tried to, uh, yeah, literally sucked it all up. <laughs> um, but yeah, I had the flu for like seven days and man, it was crazy. I was like nauseous and all that good stuff. I had a fever. I don't even know how I got it. Just some sort of germ infected me or virus. All right, you guys, so there's those awesome cards. This is this is insane. All right, we'll check out the first deck. Let's start with Exodia. I believe this is his awesome deck that Mr. Weevil ruined. I cannot believe Exodia is going to be in one star deck. That's also crazy. 
can you guys believe what's happening with this this thing? This is this is so awesome. And all the pieces are ultra rare. Oh my god. Exodia the Forbidden One. The right leg, the left leg, the right arm, and the left arm. Holy crap. Can you guys just believe they gave us an ultra rare set of Exodia in one starter deck? A forbidden left leg sealed by magic. Whoever breaks the sail will know infinite. The seal will know infinite power. Holy moly. Exodia! Obliterate! I got one of those out of me. <laughs> uh, Black Luster Soldier. Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning Common. Holy crap. Dark Magician. Dark Magician Girl Common. Summon Skull. A fiend tough with dark powers for confusing enemy. Among the fiend type monsters, most would boast considerable force. The ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense. The wicked dragon with a powerful attack. Some of the most awesome classic cards here. These almost look a little fake, it's weird. Uh, Mystical Elf, a delicate elf that lacks offense that but has terrific defense backed by Mystical Power. Punch for this creature has earth shaking results. Some of the classic cards here. Monster Born in here, Mystic Box, Brain Control, Monster Recovery. I'm pretty sure those cards in the show did not do what they say on these cards though. Horn of the Unicorn, Mystical Moon, Giant Soldier of Stone, Destroy the Moon! Burning Land with Curse of Dragon. There's another combo. Yugi and his combo cards. Oh, yeah, there's Giant Soldier of Stone, Curse of Dragon. Oh, don't forget about Guy the Dragon Champion. It is in here. Oh, man. Karibo. Dude, this is crazy. Multiplies in here. Detonate. Oh, the Magical Mist that destroyed Weevil's Great Moth Baby. Something like that. Polymerization common, Blacklist Ritual, Mirror Force common, Magic Lads, Eye of Truth, Shift. Didn't Shift like make a monster attack its own monster? It's insane. Alright, we have to sleeve these up too. This is this is so cool. I am just blown away by all these awesome cards. Who would have thought? I don't think I don't think I've ever I ever would have thought that Yugi or Konami Yugi, Yugi himself. Uh, would have given away a ultra rare set of Exodia. Not given away, obviously, but just put an ultra rare set of Exodia in a starter deck. Even if this is three starter decks, this is insane. They could put this at a hundred dollars, and people still would have bought it. <laughs> Not thirty. All right, let's look at the uh, Battle City, or whichever one has the gadgets. I'm not sure. Alright, so I believe this is Battle City because it has these awesome cards. Yeah, so this is the Battle City deck. Okay, Valkyrie on the Magna Warrior, Ultra Rare. Then the Almighty, the Evil Dark Magician. The first printing in English, I believe. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but I do not, I've never seen this in English before. This will be an epic card that everyone wants to collect. The Dark Magician, Ultra Rare, Ultra Dark. The ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense. The evil dark magician. This is so awesome. Let's look at that out of the sleeve one more time. I mean, I cannot believe they printed this card. Finally. This is so amazing. Like, if you guys are looking into Yu-Gi-Oh! for nostalgia, every single one of you needs to buy this before this pack becomes $100. This is insane. So, Valkyrie and the Magnum Warrior. No way, are the... Are they going to be... Okay. I thought the uh, pieces were going to be ultra rare. Dark Magician Girl Ultra Rare. Already, that card's worth a few dollars no matter who you're talking to. It's, it's insane. Ultra Rare Dark Magician Girl. I, think there's, I don't think this uh, art has ever been ultra rare. I think it's only been super. I'm pretty sure. Swords of Healing Light Ultra. And then an Ultra Mirror Force. Are you serious? Jeez. This is crazy. What is happening right now? Buster Blader, Archfiend Gilver, Jack's Knight, Queen's Knight, King's Knight, Perfumet, Gazelle the King of Myth Mythical Beast, Alpha the Magmore, Beta, Gamma, Big Shield Garna, Karibo, Monster Born, Dark Magic Curtain, Thousand Knives, and Magic Formula. Okay. Magical Dimension, Diffusion Wave Motion, Double Spell, Ectoplasma. What is happening? Soul Taker, Pot of Green, Card Destruction, Exchange, Monster Recovery, Polymerization, Diffusion, Multiply. Oh, Dark Paladin. Oh. Where's Dark Paladin at? Uh, double Spell. Pot of Greed. Exchange. Polymerization. Diffusion. Multiply. 
Magic Cylinder? Did they use that against a God card? Maybe it was just in the duel against the guy that had Slife. Something like that. Spellbinding Circle. Life Force Sword. Chain Destruction. Soul Rope. Tragedy. Chimera, the Mythical King of Beast. The Flying Mythical Beast. Wow. Pretty sure you're getting a... I don't even know. There's a lot of normal cards in this deck, but you get your Blacklist Soldier Envoy the beginning card. <coughs> Alright. Wow, this is, this is amazing. I am just... Look how many cards you guys were sleeving. Just so many foils. No matter what you say, each of these foils in here is worth at least a dollar. So, just think about that for a minute. Is there like 30? <laughs> I seriously think there might be 30. Oh my gosh. 15 plus 10, 25. Alright, you guys, now the final deck. This would be the uh, starter deck. Yugi's Gadget deck. And it freaking has Magician of Black Chaos. Oh, yeah, this, yeah, wow. It's been a while since I've seen this guy. He's in the premium pack, right? Premium pack one. Oh, man. Magician of Black Chaos. Man, if they would put Dark Magician of Chaos Common in here, that would have been insane. Oh, they put him in Ultra Rare? What? What? I am so glad I did not look these up. This is insane. Ultra Rare Dark Magician of Chaos is in here, too. What? What? And then an Ultra Rare Gold Sarcophagus? Ultra Rare Dark Magician? What is happening? Oh, baby! I am... What? I cannot believe Dark Magician Chaos is in here. This is insane. Oh, man. What is happening? This is worth so much. Oh, my God. I gotta get my hands on at least two more of these. I need play sets of these things. Shoot, I need like I want nine of these dark magicians and, and like nine of those treasure things at least. <laughs> what is happening, you guys? This is crazy. Magician of Black Chaos and Dark Magician of Chaos. Dark Magician, Ultra Rare, Gold Sarkov, Silent Magician Level Eight. What is going on? Oh man. Oh baby. I everyone needs to get one of these. There is this is worth so much more. This is worse. This is just so amazing. <laughs> the Dragon of Destruction, Silent Magician level 4, Silent Swordsman level 7, level 5, level 3, Dark Magician Girl. Another alternate art, Dark Magician Girl. Oh, and the first one, it was the. No way, was it so all three different. Would that be in this deck, sorry? Yeah, all three different arts of Dark Magician Girl. That's cool. Maybe there's another one in English, I'm not sure. Buster Blader, the Tricky, Jax Knight. Green Gadget, Red Gadget, Yellow Gadget, Skilled Dark Magician, Skilled White Magician, Block Man, Marsh Mullen, Cards of Sanctity. What, what does this card do? You and your opponent drop till you have six cards in your hand or something. Polymerization in the show. In the show. Magicians Unite. Dedication through light and darkness. Oh man. Black Mad Emblem of the Dragon Destroyer. What is happening? Mirror Force. Oh jeez. Dark Paladin. There he is. Oh baby. Wow, this is insane. I could sit here and just look at these cards for days. Yugi's legendary decks. Anybody that somewhat likes Yu-Gi-Oh needs to go out there and buy one of these for themselves or for whoever, or give it as a gift to whoever likes Yu-Gi-Oh at least a little bit because this, nobody will dislike this. This is so awesome. If anyone has ever played this game, you will appreciate these cards. This is crazy. What is happening right now, you guys? So a little recap, a little recap. What is going on? We have the Chaos Magicians. It's a pandemonium up in here. The Red, the Evil Dark Magician. A Ultra Rare Dark Magician Girl. That I don't think she's come Ultra Rare in that art. An Ultra Rare Mirror Force, just to back that one up. But the Red Dark Magician, you guys, never before has this come out in English. If I'm wrong on anything, I'm sorry, but just bear with me on that. 
and an ultra rare set of Exodia, you guys, in a starter deck. What? What? That is insane. The insanity, the chaos. These awesome cards here. Three new cards that have never been released. Two spellcaster support cards, and they might actually be good. <laughs> Target one of those monsters and one spellcaster, I might just send both to the graveyard. Then you can special summon a dark spellcaster dump monster from your deck. That card actually seems like it might be played. Maybe in a Dark Magician deck. But yeah, wow. Two Spellcaster support cards. The freaking Duelist Kingdom cards, you guys. Who would have thought they ever would have came out with these? Brilliant. Brilliant. And then, just to top it off, they didn't need to put these in here. Like, there, there wasn't... You didn't need to do this. But they put the God cards in here. Yeah, too bad it's not the playable ones. But still, the fact that these God cards are in here, they're still worth something. Just making this product worth way too much. And of course, a Yugi token, because now you're the king of games with all these cards. This is insane. Insanity. Wow. All the Dark Magician cards in there. You got a common Dark Paladin in here. A common Black Lester Soldier. A common Dark Magician Girl. Like, there's so many ways to make your money back. This is, this is just crazy. Wow, I, I I am just, I need to just thank Konami and the Yu-Gi-Oh! Gods for blessing us with this product, because this is just amazing. The Evil Dark Magician, that's crazy. Oh, Alright, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I posted a little later than I, than I could have, but I, as I said, I was very sick. But this is one of the most epic things I've ever opened. And once again, YouTube, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! and other TCG videos. And simply... Oh, Lucky, signing out.